Hi, I'm Karin Kusama, and you're watching Trailers from Hell. I'm so excited to be introducing Martha Coolidge's Valley Girl, which she directed and was written by Wayne Crawford and Andrew Lane. I saw this film when I was barely 14 in the theater by myself, and I think Valley Girl probably more than any art film or official high culture film title was the movie that made me want to make movies. Ow, gag me, how could you? For sure. Cody. Besides, it's totally gnarly birth control. Valley Girl is first and foremost uh, a okay. film that is marked by its like priceless dialogue for sure. It's incredibly dense at the beginning of the film with its valley speak. And apparently that was done on purpose to just sort of overwhelm the audience with the alien quality of these girls from the San Fernando Valley. Uh, but it's really beautifully, beautifully handled and very, very funny. It, the film has really incredibly appealing performances from Deborah Foreman and a still snaggletoothed Nicolas Cage. It's a simple Romeo and Juliet story set in the San Fernando Valley, and Foreman's Julie is a valley girl while Cage's Randy is a Hollywood punk. And there's something very sweet about how Hollywood is depicted as this very, very dangerous, dark place. It's sort of imagining a taxi driver for the early 80s. And it really has a very sweet, naive quality, particularly for a 13 or 14 year old girl like me when I was watching it in the Midwest. What I loved about the movie is its genuine sense of humor and its incredibly rich, 80s soundtrack. It uses music so beautifully throughout the film. I love that it had a kind of sexual frankness, particularly through the storyline of the great Elizabeth Daly. She has a lot of interesting moments that gave the film a little bit more gravity than you would think. And also Frederick Forrest and Colleen Camp as Julie's parents end up being very funny, very bittersweet versions of ex-hippies who are trying to understand their completely alien 80s valley girl daughter who's much more conservative than they ever were. When I was having a shotgun wedding for myself in 2006, I was six months pregnant at the time that I got married, my sister sent out wedding baby shower invitations and on the invitations they just had the words, man, he's like tripendicular, you know? Those were my wedding invitations to give you an idea of how much I love Valley Girl. It's getting better,